In this video, you will learn how to design a Noble Procera Titanium Custom Abutment. After setting up the case in the Dental DB with the Noble Procera production parameters, load the STL files for the case. Select your STL scan data as indicated by the software. Once the scans have been loaded, proceed through the wizard. First, under the Adjust Scan Data Orientation, nothing is required here, simply click on Next in the wizard. Next in the wizard, for Detect Implant Position, first select the implant analog that was used. In this case, we're using a Noble BioCare Titanium Abutment FDA. Next option, select the platform size. This is a Conical Connection RP. And then next, select the scan body that was used. In this case, it was an ELOS IOSA. You will see the picture and the rendering here. Click on the scan data to merge and click Best Fit Matching. Click on Next in the wizard to proceed. Next in the 3D Data Editor, make any changes required. In this example, we do not have any. Simply click on Next in the wizard. The next step in the wizard is designing the emergence profile. On Correct and Draw or Detect, select the outline for the margin of the emergence profile for your case. Once complete, click on Next in the wizard. Under the Visibility Editor, you may want to drop this down on the draw scan so you can see the emergence. You will notice pink spheres with a pink circle and arrows indicating the movements. By clicking in the green circle, this will turn the sphere green and allow you to move freely. If you click in the circle, it turns pink, that will magnetize to the emergence of the soft tissue. In the wizard, you have tools under shape, top angle and bottom angle. Again, adjusting these to the desired emergence profile for the case. There is also a free form section by clicking this tick mark and clicking on the emergence profile when it's indicated in yellow by clicking shift or control to design your desired emergence profile. Under the Advanced tab, you'll also see Move All Margins if you needed to move them all up or all down. Click on Next in the Wizard to proceed once complete. Next in the Wizard will bring you to the Secondary Insertion direction. If nothing needs to be changed here, it will default to zero degree. Click on Next in the wizard. Next in the wizard, you will see abutment design, and you will see a default abutment shape appear. Use the handles to control the design of the body of the abutment. Continuing any adjustments, click on Next in the wizard. This will bring you to the freeforming section where you have the ability to completely freeform and design your abutment. You can use the free section where you have add, remove, and smooth and flatten. Under anatomic, this will give you the ability to remove certain sections of the abutment body. Under the free section, click on the add, remove add or remove material. In this case, I'm just removing material from the facial aspect of the abutment. 
use the smooth flatten tool as well to achieve your desired shape of your abutments. And back to the anatomic section to move sections of the body of the abutment. Once the desired shape has been achieved, simply click on Next in the wizard. Last, under the wizard, under Merge and Save Restorations, you can select I'm Done when complete and select Next in the wizard. This will bring you back to the Dental BB. Now that your Noble Procera Titanium Custom Abutment has been designed, you can proceed to sending the case through Dental Share to Noble Procera Manufacturing.